To trace precedence and dependence, there's a shortcut in Excel uh, that will let you in, uh, show some arrows that tells you, you know, which which cells are dependent uh, on which cells, or which cells influence other cells. So what that means is, here in the sheet you can see that I have a couple of numbers listed up here, two, three, four, and down here, this is actually adding these cells above. And then this cell over here is taking the result and adding one to it. Okay, so to see what um, trace dependence does, if I come to this nine and I'll use the shortcut for trace dependence, which is Alt T U D, what that does is it shows you all of the cells that are dependent on the outcome of this cell. So in, that, in this case, it's 10. All right, so Alt T U D will enter this arrow into the spreadsheet that shows you that relationship. Now if I want to get rid of this arrow, the way to do that is Alt T U A. Okay, so that removes all the arrows. Uh, if I want to show the cells that precede this cell, basically all the ones that lead into this, the shortcut for that to trace um, precedence is Alt T U T. And so that shows you these you know multiple arrows in each one that leads into this cell. And again, if I want to uh, get rid of this, I'll I'll enter all T U A and that will get rid of it. Mm -hmm.